guys are back with Skipper, or Skippy, we call him. So, again, none of these have had the leash on, and, you know, you can see they all act the same, wouldn't you say? Very yeah, much so the same. So, again, if, if people, you know, Krishan knows, he put on leashes on his puppies, it didn't go too good. Um, you know, but that's what you've got to think of. You always want to use a leash like this. And can you see how it doesn't pull, so how could it really bother him too bad? So, I, again, I want to start out controlling him with movement. And if you said, how could you control any dog? Pretty much with that, so. So just by that, and I condition them really, really young to do that, and that's what you should do with your puppies. You know, if you start them out really young, they don't know any different. But look, so I'm going to get the collar on. Sean's good. He can film and uh, text at the same time. So now I've got the leash on, but there was no ritual to it. There's no ritual, and I'm not trying to make it be any different. I'm not acting any different. I gotta tell you, Henry's doing a good job. I told him, go let those dogs out, do the buckets. He's doing it. He's doing it. So, this one is trained to do one thing, give kisses. But look at it, it expects to be, yeah, that was about a fake kiss, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Oh, that was fake. There's no love behind that. No, I used to like try to give her kisses, make me give her kisses on the video, and then she wouldn't do it. So I trained her to do it. It's all fake love. She's just a little gold digger. But look at her, she just, you know, pay up, lady. <laughs> all right, so same thing with the puppy. He's got the leash on, he really doesn't even know it. But I'm still saying I'm gonna control him with movement. And I'm going to make a, the leash. I think you would want to think of it, you know, the same way that you would want to make the page a part of movement. You would want to make the leash part of movement more than you would want to make it part of uh, not moving by using it to jerk them and make them stay still and stuff. Because that's what people, the first thing they want to do is like start making them stay, start making them wait. And if I meet somebody and they're like that with me, I don't like them. Do you? No. First meet them, and then you know, the, then they always want to make them wait for their food. If I meet a new friend and we go out to eat, and they start making me wait for my food, I dump them. <laughs> <laughs> I do. So you know, I think you know, if you said that, and and that's how you guys at home have to think of it. These dogs are these people's friend, and if I said you are my friend, there would be an aspect of unconditionality to that. It wasn't conditional. So that's what you have to think of. If you're immediately making it conditional, I need you to wait, I need you to sit. And do, I'm not asking him to do anything. Follow me, maybe give me help. Yeah, look, he got swerved off the path by the leaf. Well, there's still something there. So I played my role. Rather than call him, I, I immediately turn my back. And there's a little trick. Uh, and I want you to try it with your dogs and stuff when you get home. But if you want one to move with you, you really just, if you make an abrupt movement. And I want you to think of it like this. You've seen when there's two dogs together, and then one of them suddenly cuts out. And the other one just, I don't know what he's after, but I'll go too. Mm -hmm. You know, they can't, this is what I want you to understand, Christian. They can't help themselves. You know what I mean? If they're chasing wolves or chasing, you know, they deer do. and it makes a sharp move, they they don't stand around and say, I'll make the same move. You know, and they almost mirror the movement. Mm -hmm. You know, you've seen them, you know, where they're chasing yeah. things. They're not, they don't have time to think about. Which way they're going. Well, yeah, to even like, you know, you think of people driving race cars and stuff. They're doing a lot of this on muscle memory and, and things like that. So watch. All I've got to do is just... You know, because there's an abruptness. All right, now we gotta feed them and put them back in. Put them back in? We gotta give them, feed them though. Okay, so just leave them 
leave him out and let him run around for a little bit? Well, I'm, no, I'll go get the food. I really like this guy. All right, um, we're gonna, we'll finish this video and I'll go get the food. This guy's good. He does a lot of snapping and whistling, they like him. That's a little, he's genuinely slow, but, but again, what I wanna do, you know, if you said, what did you wanna develop? If I can get him, and there's, Krishan doesn't know about this, but there's something you can do called behavior modeling, where you can get the dog to kind of copy what you do by, by little suggestions with your body language. If I can get this puppy to look down. You've got to be patient. You've got to be willing to be patient. And, and this is what I was talking about, sure. You don't want to lure them. It's more of a suggestion. Oh, shh! I can get him to do it again. You know, and if you said, well, pull him back up there, I'll never do that, I'll never do that. Because I know I can control him by this, watch. Well, if Quinny would stop rolling that ball game. So remember, my job is to keep the feet clear of that. Because what you don't want to be, you know, and if you give it to certain people, oh, every two steps the dog's getting the leash tangled. So now every two steps they're untangled. Well, it's fun. And then it just becomes just... So now I'm going to go back to get them to lay down. And all I gotta do is just kind of do the same things I did before. I kind of drop my hand in, but there's nothing in my hand. It's just a suggestion. Yeah, and that's what I talk about. He's fighting himself to do it. So me telling him to do it isn't gonna help. Yeah, he bailed on me. All right, be patient. Hey, 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 hey. Henry doesn't know I'm going to make him take him off for a walk. story. We don't believe it. We think Henry let it out on purpose. Our characters on the show. <laughs> He's like, oh no. But again, I don't really have any reaction. The puppy's not that phased by it. Oh, she'll just go down to the pond. That's how I just have no reaction. You know, and I think, you know, and that's what you have to think of. You know, you do want the dog to see you as that individual, you know, that keeps their head when all those about them are losing theirs. Alright guys, we're gonna put Quinny up and we'll come back and do a better episode of this one.